Let God arise. I'm Pastor Arlen. Today is October the 11th. And the scripture I have for you today is found in Psalms 68 verse 1. It says, Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. Do you know God has enemies? How about that? Let me ask you today, what are you letting arise in your life? So in other words, what are you focusing your words, and your energy, and all your thoughts on today? And you might say, Oh, pastor, it's just so hard right now. I lost a lot of money in the stock market, or my health just doesn't look good. And uh, somebody walked out on me today, a good friend or whatnot. See, you're focusing on the wrong things. You're letting defeat, discouragement, self-pity rise up. Why don't you just turn that around and say, God, I give it to you. Here it is. Hallelujah, I'm going to let my God arise. Because when I do, I let the enemies be scattered. See, somebody might be hurting right now. and But you know that God is the restorer of the soul. And somebody might say, I may have lost a lot of money in the stock market, but I'm not worried. Because uh, if I let God arise, my enemies will be scattered. He is my restorer. I know God is my provider. I know he supplies and meets all of my needs. I know that he is fighting my battles. See, when you start giving glory to God and letting him arise in your life, you cannot stay defeated. Your enemies will be scattered. And uh, they'll tremble at the words of faith that you speak. Because faith is all that God knows. So begin right now declaring God's goodness in your life. Let him arise so that you can move forward into the victory that he has for you. I would like to say a prayer for you. Father, I pray for everyone under my voice. Father, that we repent right now for allowing any negative, self-defeating thoughts uh, or attitudes rise up in our life. And Father, you alone are our God. And Father, we put our trust in you. And Father, today, we choose to look for the good things that you have for us. That is, we let you arise in our praise. Let you arise in our worship. Let you arise in our heart. God, we know the enemies shall surely be scattered, giving you the praise and the glory and honor. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, God bless you. So glad you joined me today. And I pray that as that you will magnify God and not the problem. And you let God arise. God bless.